Tomorrow, scientists, inventors, and engineers are kicking off their careers in Tampa this weekend. They took over the Museum of Science and Industry to learn a lot about robots. News Channel 8's Adrian Pedersen introduces us to tomorrow's leaders. No wonder they're excited. Welcome to the girls' underwater boot camp. That's right, these ladies are building robots. Submarine drones. There's actually three different kinds of propellers. It's like a muscle memory sort of thing. So the things I learn here in 10 minutes, I'm gonna remember that for the rest of my life. Even though I might just like memorize the definition in class, but I can forget that anytime at all. Yeah. Ninth grader Comfort and Yao is part of Mission Tampa Bay. Girls who wouldn't normally get the chance are working with National Geographic Explorer Erica Bergman. Seeing the girls self-guide through the entire build process, it's impressive to see that they finish the robots in lightning speed. The goal is to get girls more interested in science fields. It feels awesome. So, like, when I grow up, I would like to make inventions for people. The bigger picture things that these girls are going to accomplish in five and ten years when they're my colleagues, when we are peers together. I'm really excited to have a whole bunch of female colleagues because right now, I just don't have them. Comfort hopes to be one of those women. There's girls all over the world in Nigeria and the Arctic doing that and just being connected to a project like this is so mind-blowingly amazing to me in general. So tonight the girls you just met get the cool opportunity to sleep overnight at the Florida Aquarium. Tomorrow they'll go on a boat to test their robots. Such amazing young ladies they're really doing some great work. In the Tampa News Center, I'm Adrienne Pedersen, News Channel 8.